And she's like, what? I never said that. <laughs> Paula Francis, who, uh, well, it's alias Diana Corker. Well, in Brookside. Okay. So we're having a bit of a Brookside attack, aren't we? That's a reunion, isn't it? It I is. I was in shock. Me. I arrived and went, oh, hello. <laughs> 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 I haven't seen him for years. I know, you've been catching up. They've been sat there all the way through that guy. So what, did you ever see? Oh, I did see that one. So you a little goss. Yeah. So, so you're not actually in it at the moment, though, are you? No, I haven't been in it for a good few years now. Yeah. So, so what are you up to now? I'm doing Rita Sue and Bob 2 at the Opera House mm. from the 9th to the 14th right. of this month. Yeah. So it's really good fun. We're in York at the moment, so right. I've got to let's get off now and go to York. How many, how many different places do you go to around the country? About six or seven each right. tour. This is my second tour now. Oh, so. right. So the play goes out every couple of, well, every six well, months or something. Yeah, something like that. So you obviously have to get on with each other quite... I mean, you're living in and out of each other. There's pockets all the time, aren't you? Was it like that in Brookside? I mean, do you all, <laughs> like... Is it all very incestuous? Um, That's a big word for me. I, I, think it was, I think it was worse at the beginning. I think it's like anything, when you start on a new project or whatever, everyone kind of mucks in and then you have a good time together. But as it goes more to a business, well, mm -hmm. then it's a business and you all go your separate yeah. ways or whatever. It really you know? went big when I was there, didn't it? It went yeah. from just being in West Derby to being in Chilwell as well. There was two sets mm. and... Paul spent most of his time with the electricians and the crew. No, typical. Just big like actors. actors. Don't really act like actors. No, that <laughs> no, is you know. true. You know. So, so were, there, were there any sort of little love affairs going on and stuff like that, though? Oh, I can't be talking about all that. But there must have been. There must be a couple of things going on. I, it used to go all over my head, you know, didn't it? I, yes, I, used I to... saw a couple of airplanes <laughs> as well. <laughs> I missed a lot. Anyway, let's get on to Rita, Sue and Bob, too. Ooh, I mean, can't um, wait. this is a... Uh, it's a very raunchy tale, isn't it? I mean, yeah. I've seen the movie. I'm sure a lot of people have out there have yeah. seen the movie as well. It's, it's very similar to the movie, only the movie was two plays, whereas um, the play is obviously just one, so it, there's a different ending at the end, and all the audience are a bit surprised, so, you know, it's, it's not what they expected. Mm. But, I mean, the, the crucial scenes are there. The yeah. ones they you expect. Mean the, you mean the shagging ones? <laughs> yes, them ones. We're having a jump. <laughs> Whoa! Do you have to get your bubbies out and everything? And you? Oh no, no, no. That's, sorry to disappoint you, but no. No. Bob takes his pants down, and that's as as far as it goes. Well, oh, I take I, I take my knickers <gasps> off. There's knickers flying everywhere, actually. You don't. Like the kids. Did your mum know? Oh yeah. Oh my. My mum came to see it. Did she? Yeah. No, what was that like though when she came to see it? I mean, I was like, oh. <laughs> Just made sure she didn't have any opera glasses, you know, yeah. so she could... What was it like when your eyes met, though, after she came round, after she'd seen the show? I mean, you would bet you expected <laughs> a track record. No, she actually loved the film, so oh, it was OK. She really enjoyed you. it, she yeah. Realized. So it's you also, I mean, you've had a boob job, haven't you? Oh, I have. So was that for, for the play, or...? No, no, I, I had that done four years ago. Right. It, was, it was a reduction, by the way. I was going to say, bigger Just or smaller? <laughs> no, I, smaller. I, I, in fact, it was uh, earlier on today, I, um, I, it came back to me, <laughs> funny enough, you know what I mean? Because I you remember... Thought, oh, I remember Paula, no, the woman no, with really remember, big boobs. And then I remember how proud she was, like the, how happy she was when she'd actually got them sorted oh, out, you know what I mean? Because oh, they used to knock her in the face, you'd have to have black <laughs> eyes all the time. Is that, what, why did you have it done, then? Oh, it, they were huge, and... What Men. size were you? Well, I was only a 34 back, so yeah. I was only quite small. So but I looked, I looked really stones heavier because they, were, they went from a, a double D to an E to <gasps> a double E. And I went to get measured and she went, you're in an F. And I went, well, you can F off. <laughs> 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 she had trouble getting in the bathroom. Yeah, of course. Oh. Getting bigger and bigger. I don't know. You know when you're sprouting and you have those lumps inside yeah. where you can feel them? I still had them. I thought, oh, that's scary, that. They're going to go, like, you know, porno queen size. In fact, puzzle. we thought she had an adapter as you could come from the day. <laughs> So, so what was the operation like? I'm dead intrigued now. Well, because I was so pleased to get it done, the adrenaline sort of took me through it, you know, yeah. all the pain and all that. Mm. I jumped on the trolley when the yeah. trolley came. All the nurses were like, you know, and when I came round, I, they told me that my nipples might have gone, um, I might have lost the sensitivity, so yeah. I, I tore open the gown and, and I had a twiddle and I went, oh, I can feel them! <laughs> and I passed out, but I didn't know I had bandages round and just these nipples were on show. And I'm oh. lying there, I was lying there on the bed like <laughs> this, and I come round again and this, this guy walking up towards me, I went, oh, oh, doctor, thank you, thank you. Yeah. And he went, oh, hey, love, I'm only selling the echo. <laughs> <laughs> can, God, can you tell us what you did with the rest of them? Because there's a few people looking for this yeah. part. You know I, mean? oh, I don't know what they do. I think they vacuum them out. Right. Oh, it's disgusting. I don't want to know that part. But, no, but thanks very much. She's a real laugh coming on, actually. And thanks for talking so openly about your boobies. They're not top from where I'm sitting. I'm a girl.